Yeah, yeah, yeah. Show must go on. Oh, oh, oh. Mm -hmm. Mama, the bottom part. Just kill the man. Put a gun against his head. Pulled my trigger, now he's dead. Mama, life had just begun. But now I'm gonna throw it all away. <laughs> That's what happens when you watch Bohemian Rhapsody three times and when you listen to Queen yeah. like every day because you're in the mood for the. Well, actually, you don't need to be in the mood to listen to Queen because that's just great music. Yeah, but, because uh, you just have to see a little man in a sweet tail and scaramouche, scaramouche. <laughs> anyway, hi guys, I am Chris Kaler. And I'm still Amber Frost from Kajun Cosplay. And we are uh, back for another episode of Black Mirror, this time. Season 4, episode 3, named Crocodile. Crocodile. Uh, I have no idea though what the title means. Uh, last episode we had, I had some kind of an idea, even though it ended up not being it at all. <laughs> not being what I thought at all. This time, what Crocodile, thought? I thought it was about a little kid who was like, so good and so perfect and I don't know. And, you know, it ended up being like the little angel on your shoulder type of episode. But this time with Crocodile, I don't know what to be expecting other than that she has my air cut when I <laughs> cut it very short. <laughs> anyway, we'll see what it's about. Let's watch it. Let's see it, guys. I like that song. Just a boo. How did he not see him though? Him or he her? He was driving. Hi. Yeah. Ah. Oh my gosh. We, we've been fucking caning it, yeah? yeah. I, 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 this is prison, yeah? The fucking instant prison. I, I've got fuck knows how much drinking me. I fucking hit a guy. And they will put me in the cell. I'm the driver. The there's, 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 a, there's a leak over there. There's a sleeping bag in the boot. You keep an eye on the road. Keep an eye on the road. No. That's worse, throwing the body away. No. I mean, of course you're going to be in trouble if you were high driving and stuff, but that's worse. I don't know why, but I kind of imagine like Google Map with a van. You know, sometimes you see strange stuff. <laughs> and it's just about throwing a body away. But I mean, there are so many possibilities here. Like, they probably have the bike's paint on their car. Um, so I'll start with a funny story. She changed her life. She's got, a She's got a life now and family. <laughs> it's gonna come back and bite her in the ass. Okay. Well, when you got a shitty past, it tends to do that. Don't you think so? You killed someone, but I'm gonna be alright. No, you're not. Why? You're in a Black Mirror episode. <laughs> Always the same freaking song. <laughs> We're gonna know it by heart by the Always end of this. Always the same problem. You can't blame me. Try to shake me. Still, I'll be uh, there for you. I said, Ben, it's been like two years now, hasn't it? That's right. Dropping in my hotel room, that must be important. Do you want a drink? Uh, not good on the head. Are you quit like fully quit? Nine months, three weeks, two days. Congrats. Well. I've been, I've been thinking about it again that night. Well, I can't not think of it. We'll put it out of our minds. Mia? That, that's her. It's his wife. You don't know that's his wife. There is a photo of him at the bottom. It's him. So she never remarried. She, she never fucking moved house. She stayed where she is in case he came back all this time, Mia. She's still waiting for him. I'm going to write her a letter. They can trace it back to find the body of Ben Fonda. Find those two. Yes, they will not a fox. No. Fuck. It was your idea. It was your fucking idea. I've got a son. 
Sonny's nine years old. You've seen photos of him. Think of him, please. I'm sorry. If he doesn't mention her, how are they going to find out if she was in the car? She wasn't driving or anything. Hey. No, 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 no. What are you doing? Is she going to kill him or something? Mia, I'm fucking leaving. What the fucking... Go! Fuck! What did you do? Whoa, I was saying that as a joke. She's actually killing him. That's on you, though. It's way worse! The other one was a hit and run, but... And she wasn't in... You know, she wasn't driving or anything, but that's... Did she stab him? Because I think I saw something on the, on the ground. A bottle of alcohol. Well, she's fucked. <laughs> she's gonna dump him in the same lake. <laughs> It's kind of a giveaway, though. The huge, the truck, drag mark, truck mark in the snow. Dragon mark. What is it? It's gonna boil. How are they gonna connect? She works for the insurance company. I'm not sure how her job and her role in all this is gonna tie in with the main girl. As I'm sure you appreciate, with a payout of this size, we will need to investigate the circumstances of the accident. Yeah, of course. It's one of those um, memory treasures. <laughs> we prefer corroborators. Ouch. So. This accesses engrams, your memories of what happened. Now, they are subjective. They may not be totally accurate and they're often emotional, but by collecting a range of recollections from yourself and any witnesses, we can help build a corroborative picture of the whole. Went to a sort of comic shop, culty stuff. Um, there was music from a car. I like that song. There's a woman in a yellow coat coming towards me. What you've given me is already useful. Really? Oh, I've got someone to look for. She's going to investigate, but it happened at the same time, so I'm guessing she's going to find something out. Ooh. Well, she's uh, looking for witnesses. Yeah. 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 To this, understand better mm. what happened yeah, during the night. And like if she sees her memories, she's gonna see the murder. If you close your eyes, I'm also gonna play a piece of music. God, yeah, yeah, that, that was on. It's all the aftermath, really. A moment earlier, you saw a bright light. Yeah. Like a camera flash just before, just outside the dentist place. <laughs> She's gonna open a can of worms. I kinda like it though, it's kind of different. The technology ain't so bad. Yeah, that's case. what I was thinking. Like in this case, I'm actually for the technology. <laughs> Look, to be honest, the memory's a bit embarrassing, isn't oh, it? Don't worry, I've seen it all. Your memories will be sealed in private, unless they indicate you're harming yourself or another person. Go on, then. I saw some woman staring at something. So I looked down, it was just a load of commotion. Oh, bless you. Wow, that was easy. Well, not really. He might be the one. I mean, I'm sure she can actually say, I don't want to show you my memories. But, uh, if she saw the crash or the accident. Can she just show the crash, though? It was right at the, it, it was at the same moment. So I'm guessing it's impossible. And she's been obsessing over this. So she'll think of that first thing first. Do you 
mind if I ask you a few questions about it? It won't take long. I'm sorry, I'm really busy. I've got, I've got. I don't want to sound heavy, but it is a legal requirement since last year. It's a legal requirement. Well, if you've witnessed an incident, yes. But I have to notify the police when people refuse and when they get involved, it just drags everything out. So. You're fucked. <laughs> oh oh. Look, I don't care what you might have been doing in the hotel room in your own time. <laughs> yeah, you'll care. Don't ask anything moment. about that. Don't go there. No, there are knives. No, 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 no. 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 She's got a husband and a kid. No, yeah, and a kid at home. I hate hotel food. I had room service. I hate room service. With no hotel room in my own. She's trying to Mosh focus palm. on her memory. Mosh palm. Let's see if it works. She can try to pass it off as like violent porn. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh my god! Uh, that's, that's violent my... porn. Okay, I'm into shady stuff. <laughs> what? Well, if she hadn't acted as scared, maybe it would have passed. She's crossed a line right there. <laughs> you don't say so. Sorry. Well, what is she gonna do? She's gonna leave her here? You can tell someone, aren't you? Mm -hmm. I know, but even if you say you won't, your recollections are all recorded. Oh. I'm not. Oh, no. Please, I've never spilled any. I'm not allowed to. It's the law. It's like confession, it's like Catholic confession. It'd be illegal for me to say anything, totally illegal, even if I wanted to. Yeah, but now you saw a murder. No, she she said that if she murdered someone, oh, if she hurt someone, she had to report it. So she's lying right there. Did you tell anyone they were coming here today? No. Lying. I'm not. I swear, I'm not. Lying. No, I swear. Who did she speak to? Bingo. Me and Owen. If you'll talk. If you'll talk. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh, seriously. I'm really sorry. She's gone from a witness to a murder to like full on Serial psychopath. And she's gonna attack the husband now? Oh oh. Fuck. Oh fucking hell. You've got a kid, damn it! They already got a kid? Yeah, I heard the kids, you know, cry earlier. <laughs> yeah, you just murdered two parents. Deal with that. Possible for the child to remember her. Yep. Who just plays that? Uh, the mafia stuff? Twenties vibe play, I guess. 
Please, please, be the child, be okay, please. Because a baby. What? Probably someone worried about leaving a witness. But I couldn't see. Poor fucker was born blind, apparently. So I have to say, I have absolutely no idea what I'm looking for. There's a good job in not asking me. Are you kidding me? She did all of that? And a freaking hamster. It's not a hamster, though. It's well, it's gonna be a, 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 a pig. There you go. It's over. So we don't even get the satisfaction to know that she's been arrested. Well, we know she's gonna get arrested because they were there for her. All we get is the paranoia at the end that she's gonna get caught, she's gonna get caught. Well, in, in that case, actually, I don't. it's not paranoia. I want her to get caught. She freaking killed a child. I'm sorry. It was already too much at her friend and then the woman. I'm sorry. And then I had horrible feelings when she killed the, the husband. But the freaking child, that's a no-go. God. Who kills a freaking baby? Such a cute baby, too. Monsters. Damn it. I, th I think that's the, actually the first time in Black Mirror that we have a an episode with the main character being so bad, but we know it from the beginning of the episode. Like in Shut Up and Dance, he was doing like tri pornography, but we didn't know. Or just no idea. <clears throat> yeah, but in this case, I think we knew. Even though she wasn't the one driving, um, she was at fault for not telling the police that they killed someone. She was an accomplice, yeah. Yeah, she helped dump the body. So she is. She was involved from the very beginning. And when her friend decided to come clean, or at least send a letter to the wife... The widows. The widows. I mean, it was his choice, and she was really scared that he was going to destroy her life. But then she went so paranoid. It. She had it in her. I mean, she had it in her. She, if she was capable of doing it once, she was cap capable of doing it twice, and uh... Oh gosh. But I think that's actually the first time in Black Mirror that I'm not completely against this technology, I mean... Oh, me neither, I'm not completely against yeah. it. The only thing uh, I could say, I think, is that it's... So, it, it seems so easy to alter someone's memories. Like, if she wasn't so freaked out about what she did, she could have just remembered the accident and not remembered the murder. She kind of altered her perception. Like, she remembered watching the the thumbnail of the porn movies passing through, and then she remembered the food she saw, and then she remembered the accident. But if she had just stopped there, that's all the woman would have seen. So, yeah, I think that this technology is not advanced enough but it's to a good show start. everything, it's yeah, a good start though. But uh, yeah, in that way, the, the way that we're using it in this episode, it's actually very good. The only thing is that, like I said, it's not probably you cannot rely on it too much, unless, like you said, you have yeah. multiple witnesses. Like she said, you need multiple witnesses to kind of have a, a bigger idea of what happened. But I, um, I, I liked. I enjoyed how they handled it in this episode. Like she mentioned that they there there were rules. She couldn't legally uh, report anything she saw unless, like, the... Hurt someone. Or himself. Yeah, that's what she said. So, yeah. For for the first time in Black Mirror, I'm not against the technology <laughs> show no, here. That, that's the first. I think that's, that's because, well, it was used against a bad guy or the, ba the bad woman in that yeah. scenario. It was used to arrest her. But why is it called Crocodile. If you know, just write it down. I'm really interested in yeah. knowing why. Uh, I don't know either why it's called Crocodile. The only thing I had in mind about this was that Crocodiles likes to lay low. They like to lay low. And uh, when their prey is right there in front of them, that's when they're going to jump. And it's an instant. It's going to be killed in an instant. But I don't know much about Crocodiles other than that. So And when, once you're... Or actually, once you're stuck in their jaws, it's, you cannot, you know, un, unclench their jaws. Once you're stuck in there, you're done. They're not going to let go. It's a bit like a pit bull, if I remember. Yeah. Is it pit bulls? Pit bulls. 
that their jaws lock. Yeah. Well, I think crocodiles do the same, or if they don't do the to same, hit their eyes or their nose if I'm right. Or yeah, something but like that. I think crocodiles, if they don't lock their jaws, um, they're still pretty strong, and once their their jaws close, yeah, it's kind of impossible to open them by yourself. So if that's what this means, well, she was locked into this whirlpool of bad things happening and murder. Guys tend to drown their their prey before they to kill them. Yeah, I don't really see a point in this episode um. though. Like I have to, my two theories, I don't know, uh, people will tell us, I guess. <laughs> and if I get some theories about why they name it Crocodile, just write it down and yeah. we discuss it with you. Uh... God, but I wasn't expecting it to go like that. Like, I thought she would stop after her friend. But even the friend was too much, especially since he was trying to atone for his sins. He was the, the one that did the wrong thing at the beginning, because she wanted to call the cops, and he's the one who said, like, no, don't call them, I'm gonna end up in prison. But uh, he wanted to... Uh... It reminds me of a story that one of my driving teacher told me during one of my classes. Uh, he said that they, they, um, they used to have a driver on the, in the newspapers who had a case of sleep driving. And someone working there? No, uh, he, he heard a case of someone who, sleep dri who, sleep, okay. who did the sleep driving. And said that uh, the driver in his sleep can't have a dream where he was um, bumping something on the road, and when he opened his eyes, he saw that he bumped on, into cyclists. I don't know yeah. how many of them he he. I heard about that. Drive o over. Every bump in this dream was someone he was, was someone, driving yeah. over. I heard that story. And there, there were many of them. I I don't know how how many, but. There was a, a f there was a few, and but he reported it or something. Yeah, yeah he was arrested for it. But yeah, it's it, no it, matter it, how it happens. If you are drunk, high, or sleep deprived, don't drive. Don't drive. <laughs> don't drive. And even even then, I mean, stand up for what you did and face the consequences of your actions. Cause I mean, you're 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 fucked. He he rode over someone. He was already fucked. And even though he was he wasn't caught, he still had it on his conscience for like eighteen years. I think and she like said. And like you said, since they never kind of find bodies, uh, the family waits for it forever. Yeah, and they never can they never can could move on. Yeah, they can't move on. But uh, yeah, she wasn't ready to face the consequences of her actions, so she was so desperate because yeah, she didn't because want to lose. Because she uh, restarted her life. She, yeah, she, she moved on. She moved on. She made a, a family. She tried to uh, live a better life. But now, I mean, how bad is it gonna get now? Like, okay, eighteen years ago, my friend, my friend, rode over someone, and I was terrified. I wanted to call the police, but my friend. Uh, decided not to. Uh, said friend wants to atone for his sin and just come out and say he did it. But anyway, so yeah, he convinced me to dump the body and I just let it go. Okay, she's gonna pr she's gonna go to prison. She's gonna you know have to go to court and stuff. But it's it won't be as bad as uh, well. Then said friend wanted to come out and since I didn't want it to happen, I killed my friend. And then this woman found out and I killed her too. And since uh, and she since had a husband, she told her husband I killed her husband too. <laughs> And, and then there's a the child on so my face. I killed a child too, but I forgot the guinea pig. I would have killed the guinea pig. <laughs> but I was an animal lover, so I didn't. God damn it. No, oh. she she started like I did I never actually cared about this character, but uh <laughs> no, now I, I hate her. You don't touch a child like this. You don't kill a child and you don't kill act you don't no kill, one. Don't kill but point. Uh, not after I see the child. The, the, this child is too <laughs> cute. To be oh. murdered like that. I'm sorry. And could you imagine the, the little boy during his uh, musical show at his... Yeah, his mom's gonna get arrested. There you go. She not only managed to destroy her own life, she destroyed her children, her child's life, her husband's life, and the life of an entire family. That poor guinea pig is alone now. <laughs> You're just sad for the guinea pig. No, I mean, it's because... <laughs> no, no, I understand, I understand. They probably have families of their own. Yeah, they, they have, have parents and... Friends. Yeah. Other families, too. She completely destroyed an entire family because she was too scared of losing her own. For something she all... She, 
she didn't actually do, but, you know... No, she's completely the bad guy in this episode. Anyway. Oh, but yeah, so please tell us if you know what crocodile means in oh, this What do you episode. think it means? Yeah, what do you, maybe it's just an assumption, I don't know. But uh, yeah, did you enjoy this technology like us, or do you have something to say against it? Just well, what could go wrong with this? Like, except oh, for the... you just didn't like J2 because this isn't for Black Mirror. <laughs> Depends. It's actually very different from what Black Mirror does usually. Yeah, but, uh, it's kind of a little bit more sub than usual. But I've been saying that for the past like three episodes. <laughs> <so. laughs> anyway, okay. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, See you in the next one. See you soon. Bye.